Glyn Hodges and narrow defeat here, the whole city tonight when the Dons gave absolutely everything. How do you sum up the performance? I'm oh, really good. I'm uh, pleased. Uh, we took the game to them and we, you know, we, um, you know, we thought we, some of our football was excellent. We carved out the two best chances first half and really you got to take one. Um, you know, you take one of them and come into half time. I know all that they scored in the 53rd minute or something like that, which uh, was you know a bit was, was was wasn't great on our part, and, and we've got to learn from that, and, and we have learned a big lesson today. Yeah, what what could we have done better to make well, things? We, well, we we played against a team there who's probably experts on set pieces, and they scored two the weekend, scored another one tonight, and when we when we're attacking them, they uh, they grapple you, they throw you to the floor. Uh, George Honeyman, I think he got all of said, and that should have been a penalty, and the referees aren't giving them so. We're a bit, we're a bit too nice. I think we're nice boys, and we've got to probably take that, take that ugly side of what they, they throw at you. In some ways, it was the acid test. Is a team are probably going to go up at the end of the season. Um, how do you sum up the way we matched up against them? No, I thought, no. I thought apart from that, apart from that corner, um, I can't remember Connell making any particular saves. Um, so. You know, we were asking questions at the end, but I mean, yeah, they, they they defended well as well. So I thought it was I thought it was a good game, and it was just one that you, you're scratching your head because we, we deserve something from. And there was changes tonight in terms of personnel and the system. What was the thinking behind it? Uh, well, uh, Ethan had a, got blacked out when he got hit in the face by uh, Joe Piggott on Saturday, so we, it's obviously a concussion there. We've got to follow the protocols, and uh, and just Ryan, you know, it's his first uh, foray into League One football, so it's just a lot of games and a lot of time, and I thought. Rudy come in and did tremendous anyway. It was, it was, you know, it was the, the boys. This again, the, the squad's good, and the boys who you can bring on and they play their part. They know how we play, and I thought they, they, you know, they were really good when they came on today. And Callum as well. A slight tweak to the system with Jack supporting Joe in, in attack. How did you think that went? Yeah, I thought it went well. I just thought well. Just thought looked at Ryan, looked at uh, Rudy, and we weren't going to complete the full. The full yeah. 90, and uh, I don't think he's had the really. He's only had like 45 as in, in the start by the start of the season back in early August. So, you know, he's a fit boy anyway, but I knew he'd run out of legs. But you know, I was pleased with his uh, his contribution. Yeah, and he's a, he's a real plus now for the squad moving forward, isn't he, Jack? Yeah, well, look at that. This, this, I'm, I'm pleased with the squad. Yeah, just Jack, there's, there's lots on there. And there's some unfortunately aren't getting a game at the moment. So, you know, it's uh, time will tell, but I'm sure they're, they're going to have an impact. So moving forward, this is one we can really take confidence from heading to Burton on Saturday. We can, but also leaves you know also leaves a you know, horrible taste in your mouth because we've got we've got beat the last two games we've got beat. We haven't had a shot to save and we've conceded two two set pieces. But like I say, today is probably I like to think there's there's a moment that we all we've all we all um, a big conversation here. Everybody contributed and. And we've got, we've got. Hopefully, we've got a solution. But we know how we, how we're going to do, how we're going to defend moving forward. So there's a feeling in the dressing room of you know we can move on from this and really take some. Oh, we're close. Oh, we're close. This is this is a champion. I say this is a championship. That you're saying they're going to go up. Yeah. So we've come in here and they were hanging on. They were hanging on. They weren't the referee to blow the whistle. Um, disappointed that we had six minutes injury time first half and the amount of time the ball the ball suddenly disappeared and the balls weren't coming back and the referee said he had it he uh, he didn't give us any any time on we only had three minutes so um, you know it's, it goes with these little things that, that, that annoy you but the more the biggest thing that annoy you is uh, is is conceding that goal. Okay, Glenn, unlucky. Thank you for joining us. Cheers. Cheers.